Hello, my beautiful Aries. Welcome to your next three months general energy loves. But I want for all of you to bring channels messages for this three months that you are seeing. Three months from the time you see this video or three months from January to March. I am recording this in mid-March almost to the full moon in Leo. But let's see. Three major blessings, three major events that's coming in for you. Let's see them. And these messages are for the Aries who have sun, moon or rising signs in Aries. Let's see. Aries, the next three months for you. Let's channel the energies that are coming in. You might be aware, you might do not. Three of Wands. Definitely here you are looking forward for certain changes. But it seems here three months is quite too long for you. That's what I'm hearing. With the Three of Wands, it's like you're looking for something quicker than three months. Could be three weeks, three days. Yes, look at this. Three of Wands, Three of Cups, Nine of Swords, Eight of Cups, Seven of Cups, and Death. Absolutely. You're looking for definitely a change. And this change, you're not sure if you do the right thing or not. But Spirit says, once you ch make this change, you will know clearly if you've done the right decision or not. Spirit says, in a big picture, you will feel relieved from whatever is or whatever you've been through. I also see here there is an Aries who might change the location where they live. Because with the death, this is a big change that's going to happen. And if you are looking for a relocation, you may relocate with some friends or family. But definitely here feels like you, you're moving to a new environment. The first card, we have Two of Cups, High Priestess, and the Hermit. I see you very... The, the air sounds speaking here. You, you could be a very spiritual... Aries, where you are very much into spirituality. I don't feel here you are talking very much with too many people here. Or whatever here you want to do or start, you might not tell anyone or very few will know. Because High Priestess and Hermit doesn't speak. Okay? And it seems here that this energy really speaks that I I was thinking of this for quite a while and now is the chance. Now is the, is the time I'm looking for. Whatever move you do, it's for your own happiness, for your own good, most likely. For others of you, you, you plan very meticulously a change in your life or a move in your life. But let's see here what the Hermit wants to say. Hermit, Virgo energy, High Priestess, Piscean energy. For some of you, March, or the month of March, is very, very strong or will be the turning point. Because I'm hearing a turning point in your life that you've been thinking for quite a while at it. The Hermit Energy, Nine of Pentacles. The Magician. Oh, yes. You, you're definitely here taking, taking a leap of faith and Ten of Wands. There's something here you are leaving behind. And it's not like... It's kind of was hard to leave it, but necessary for your own growth and for your own expansion. Seven of Swords. It's like even looking like you want to run away from something. But you know you can't achieve something unless you let go this with the star here. 
for some of you you are you've been kind of guided by your angels by your 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 own guides or you deep down you know you gotta do this because unless you're not gonna do you'll never get there what's the high priestess here for queen of pentacles page of wands seven and then the nine of wands the the devil and it's kind of like quietly and surely you gotta make this decision it's like this decision was no better the other way unless nobody will know okay because somebody here it's it's getting into your privacy or somebody here always wants to know what you do or what you up to and whatever here you do it's kind of gotta happen quick fast and done so for some of you you might change your job your career your place where you live for others of you you are make this change in regard to relationship that you want to get out because other is it's kind of if they will know they will hold me back or i will hold back or something here will uh, will turn not in your favor so it's kind of like secrecy is needed or silence is needed for this matter what advice we have from spirit or what else we have for you from spirit ten of pentacles for some of you, especially if you are into a family or a family energy here or married even with someone, it's not like for some of you, you know, could be the, the, the worst scenario, this is like abuse, but for some of you, you, you do this for... For some of you, this is your family, your friends, the immediate family here. Yes. Or it could be someone who always promised things, and but it's only working for them. Could be even, you know, words, abusive through the words or words wise. I, it's kind of like you, you, anyway, you are not out there anymore like whatever here you try doesn't work but it's it's kind of the things not working because either they don't understand you or you don't understand them because the opinions are very very different from one another and the the only three missing here now is three of swords you kind of like done being hurt or done feeling hurt or done feeling you know silent or done feeling all by yourself in this because some of you might be in a in a relationship but feel very lonely so now it's kind of that move gotta happen yeah and whoever is this person definitely they don't want you to see there's other better things out there. But yeah, they are. So Spirit says, definitely here, there's something that you need to start working for you or do for you. If you want to have a much better life. A very very traditional or 3d energy here from whoever you are dealing you you truly believe there is a universe you truly believe that you are guided you truly believe into the um, the energy that is pouring to your life and i see here also an aries it's kind of like your light is fading away just staying where you are no matter the situation here okay but it seems here like you you kind of like you know how someone runs away and not even looking back that's how i'm seeing you it's like i gotta run and i don't want to look back because i might turn back 
and I don't want back. There's something here like that. What advice we have for you? Star, do what you feel it's right for you or do what you've been prayed for. Yeah, look at this underneath. The Emperor, take action, loves. And it's time for you to enjoy you. Okay. It's kind of somebody here. You don't want to lose time. You don't, don't want to lose the, the young, you know, years around something that you you don't want or you, you're not feeling you belong. Yes. Because there's something else you do want. And look at here, the, the star and the nine of cups, both are wish energies. I Whatever I want and way I want, where I am now is not what I want. Ace of Wands. And definitely feels here you you're taking action, loves. For some of you, you feel more grown up than ever. And for that reason, you take this leap forward. Which that is quite, quite amazing. And I have also a, a Oracle card for you, loves, which quite in a while didn't use the Oracles, but here we are. Let's see what advice we have from the oracles. Stepping into power. You are strong beyond measure. So definitely here there's something about taking action, taking the leap of faith. And look at here. For those of you who are asking, am I doing the right thing? That's your answer. Get gates of triumph. Success expands in your life. So there is a successful move that you should take or you would like to take or you wanted to take for quite a while. Okay. So either you do it now or you're doing a little later. It's kind of sooner or later you will make the same move as you do it now. So yeah, Aries. That's your next three months in general energies. I hope this resonates and speaks to you. If it does, let us know. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.